What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hello, my name is Sudi. I first off would like to appreciate each and one of my new subscribers. We've been growing throughout these two years that I have not been posting. Honestly, you guys have motivated me to sit down and film a video for you guys and show you guys my new life, what I've been up to. I've grown so, so much since the last time I was here on YouTube, you guys. And I can't wait to show you guys a little bit more about me and what I've been doing and who I've been around and all that good stuff. So yeah, let's, let's get straight into the video. Um, this is a life update about me. Ah! I'm so excited, you guys. Honestly, I this is what feeds my soul to be like on camera and, and talking to you guys. And this year especially, um, it's about to end. We are almost about to hit the last month of the year, which is December. And yeah, you guys, I just wanted to come on here. I now have the time to be posting at the time. I, I didn't, when I was new to YouTube, I was posting and honestly, it was going great. My subscribers were going up little by little as I was posting videos. I was doing vlogs. I was a mother of one. Now I am a mother of two, you guys. I now have a baby girl. For those of you who have not been updated on my life on instagram i do post a lot on instagram if you guys don't have me um added um i will link it down below so you guys can go ahead and follow me and yeah you guys my stories are always popping i'm always posting about my personal life about my business life and yeah i can't wait to like let you guys know everything everything where i've been what i've been up to who i've been hanging out all that good stuff and honestly it's very very important who you surround yourselves with because that's who you are it's true hay un dicho en español que dice dime mi mamá siempre me decía dime con quién te juntas y te diré quién eres somewhere within those lines and it's true it's true you guys surround yourself with great people people who want to see you grow people who who love pushing you to do better to be better um let's go back two years back so at the time i was posting on youtube i um it was really really hard i was learning how to edit i was learning how to post i was learning how to like be myself on camera it's it's a little hard i'm not gonna lie it's a little hard to connect with someone through camera um in the beginning it, it's it's a little difficult if you guys follow me on social media on instagram you guys know i'm always popping i'm always posting my stories but when it comes to youtube i feel like it's a whole new other level you guys um first off you need to learn how to edit if you don't have an editor for your for your videos so i was doing it all i was a stay-at-home mom at the time um 24 7 with zane uh, he did come up come out on some of my vlogs so you guys probably saw him um he's five now my baby boy is five i now have a daughter her name is alani she's about to turn two in april of next year and i'm very blessed you guys i'm very blessed Every time I I just get ready, like every time I get ready and be myself to like the full potential and like be out in the streets, I know what I bring to the table. Like I always do and I've always known what I've wanted in life. But I just feel like now I have the time. I have I switched up my habits, which habits, which is very, very important. Um I'm a new person, you guys. I've grown so much throughout these two years. Um, and I just want to come on here and just keep up with my videos and posting and my kids are full-time in daycare So now I have the time to sit down and film and edit and all that good stuff um, Let's go back two years back. So at the time I was posting on YouTube every time Zane would go to sleep I was editing when I was around my family. I was always around my family. It was it was hard you guys. It was hard um they would always tell me like they would see it as a game honestly my family would see it as like i'm just joking around and just filming and doing it for pleasure and at the time i was seeing it as business like it's 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 a business you guys it's a whole fucking new game you're posting you're editing you're doing everything and it's a lot it takes a toll on you and i had to stop eventually i had to stop i wasn't happy being on camera i felt like every time i would turn on the camera like i i, I wasn't me i was feeling like down um, I would get a lot of comments from my family and that's very very common you guys I would get a lot of comment comments about how I would talk the bad words I would say my mom she would never say nothing negative she's always been someone who has pushed me but she's always been on my ass on posting in Spanish I understand 
There's a lot of people out there who would love to hear me speak in Spanish. So yeah, I will be uplo uploading more videos on Spanish. Um, hablo muy bien el español. Vengo de una familia muy me mexicana. Um, but this video, I'm just introducing myself as me. I speak a lot of Spanglish. I am near the border. So it's very, very common for us to speak Spanglish. But yeah, you guys, I right now, two years in, after I posted um, my last YouTube channel, I'm a mother of two. I am a boss babe at Body Bar SD. Um, for those of you who do not know, and you guys are here in the Chula Vista area and the San Diego area, Body Bar SD is located in Chula Vista. We offer a lot of great beauty services um, in the industry, and I just love saying that. We offer a lot of beauty industries. We have a lash tag. We offer body sculpting. Body sculpting is our main core at Body Bar. Um, we do fat dissolves, lip fillers, we offer nails, we offer full waxing, everything, everything. I offer facials, you guys. I started off as a body sculpting specialist with Saira. Saira is the owner of Body Bar SD. Um, I can't wait to introduce her to you guys. Um, she's been a, I guess you could say a great mentor, even though she doesn't know she's a mentor of mine, but she has, she has, and I've grown so much with her. And it's beautiful to surround yourself with women who are very, very empowering. And they want to see you do better. At the time, from the last time I posted on my YouTube channel, I was a full stay-at-home mom. Um, and I didn't really know what it was to like work for someone or work with someone. Um, I was always like with my family. I was always with my family. I was working. I never really had a real legit job. Um, I've had a couple jobs here and there, maybe for like a month, and I would quit. I was always a daddy's girl. My dad owns a business as well. And I've always had everything come to me in in a very, very great way to the point where like I was never really pushed to hustle. And that's the truth, you guys. As as crazy as that sounds, it's the truth. I was pregnant. I came out pregnant with Zane and I had to stop working. Um, I am married. I have I had a Zane at the moment and I was a stay at home mom and it was very, very common in our family to stay at home and take care of your kids. Thank God I was also very blessed at the fact that like my husband could um, work for all of us, which is me and my son. And I was at home just being a mom and I was loving it. Honestly, I would always get comments about like, how do you do it? Like, no te aburres estando en tu house. Like, you don't get bored being home. Like, how do you do it? And honestly, I, I loved it. I, I loved it. It was something I saw my mom growing up. When I was growing up, I saw my mom do it at home. She was always home. She was a great stay-at-home mom. And it was beautiful. It was beautiful. But eventually, I was posting on YouTube and I was posting on social media. And Saira reached out to me. Saira is the owner of Body Bar SD. She was barely starting her own business. And she reaches out to me. I don't know if it's because I was posting so much on social media and I was just being me. But I, I, she attracted herself to me or I attracted myself to her. And um, she reached out and she told me like, hey girl, I want to um, meet up with you. I, I started a business and I think you'd be great being part of Body Bar SD. And I would love to have her here on the channel so she can speak her side of the story. And yeah, you guys, we've done so many great things. We're about to hit three years this upcoming year at Body Bar SD. Business is great. I never imagined from being a stay at home mom to being my own boss to being a mother of two now. It's, it's been crazy. It's been a roller coaster. I, it's been a while. Like it's, it's been great. I've grown so much, especially this year. I feel like I've always been so, so true to myself. And this year I've been growing so much in the fact that like I got into personal development. I got to learning more about other people here on YouTube, mentors. Um, and yeah, you guys, I'm here now and I, I can't wait to teach you guys all these new things um, about how to grow, like how to grow. I, I honestly, this video is probably going to be all over the place, but I've honestly grown so much and I feel very blessed and very grateful. And I can't wait to tell you guys everything I've done throughout these years that I haven't been here on YouTube. And yeah, Saida reached out to me going back to that story. She reached out to me and she's like, hey, I think you'd be great at Body Bar. Whatever, we start, we hustle. I come out pregnant months in being at Body Bar. 
um, I was doing body sculpting at the time. And for those of you who do not know what body sculpting is, it is a machine that we use to burn fat. It has radio frequency and lipocavitation, cavitation, and it's not a for sure that it could affect the baby while being pregnant, but it's it's a possibility. So you, me, I didn't want to risk myself. Saida didn't want to put me at risk with me and my baby. So business stopped completely. Keep in mind, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I, I'm a princess. I'm a queen. I'm, I get everything my way in a way. I start hustling and I start being a new person, hustling my ass off. Business is great. Clients are coming in and out the door. And then out of the nowhere, it's like, you're not, you're no longer working. And it's like, what do I do now? What do I do with my life now? And thank God I am a licensed cosmetologist. I've had my license since 2011. So one day I was sitting down with Saida, my pregnant ass in front in the front desk. And um, she was waiting on her next client. I was, I was there at the time. It, it was a struggle you guys to find a babysitter for me to get back into like hustling pretty much as a mother. And, um, I had a, I had Zane in daycare at the time. Saida was so desperate in the way that like, I know it sounds crazy, but she was so desperate in the way that she wanted more for me. Like she wanted to see me grow. So one day she's like, girl, I was struggling at the time. Thank God I've always had a very, very great support system when it comes to my family. My sister was helping me out a lot. My sister-in-law was helping me take care of Zane at the time as well. And um, it was hard because by the end of the day, as a mom, the responsibility of the child is yours. So it was, it was a little, it was a little tricky for me. So Saida one day told me, she's like, girl, honestly, this was way before I came out pregnant. She's like, honestly, take Zane to my daycare lady. At the time, the daycare lady, she was popping as well. Like she didn't have time to fit in any kid, but thank God she made an exception with Zane and she was taking care of Zane. But Saida was like, please take Zane to so-and-so and I will pay the first day for daycare. Like just give it a try. Keep in mind, um, it's very, very common to be a stay-at-home mom in my family um, and and taking him to some, somebody who really doesn't know who the kid is or we don't know who the lady is, it's scary, you guys. It's very, very scary. And thank God, and I really appreciate God every day for bringing Saida into my life because all of this is new to me. All of this is new to me. I take Zane. She takes care of the baby. Um, eventually, he's there full-time. So I'm hustling, hustling, hustling. I come up pregnant and i can no longer do cavitation whatever we're sitting in the front desk and i'm like i was sad i was sad because honestly the beauty industry itself it's it's great money you guys so um money stopped completely for me but once again i have my husband who always backs me up and all the money all the money that i make myself it's pretty much for me and for to bring in money like for my family or whatever like extra pretty much extra so um I'm just sad and I'm like what am I gonna do now like how sad and I was like you know what I can offer facials like facials we can offer facials whatever Saida's over here like on her phone she's always like on her fucking phone and then she's like you're right you can't offer facials because I had commented about it but I guess she was doing her research and um I started doing facials you guys and I love it I I love how peaceful it is um Comparing facials to body sculpting, honestly, I prefer doing facials. Body sculpting is amazing as well, but facials just soothes me. Especially being pregnant, it's very, very relaxing. Um, I never imagined in my life doing facials because I'm a person que soy un poquito asquerosa, like me asco, like any little thing. And I thought extractions and all that, especially being pregnant, I was gonna be a little grossed out about it, but I love it and I enjoy what I do. And yeah, you guys, the business is great. We are almost three years in and we are very blessed. And me especially, I'm very, very blessed. And I feel like I've grown so much. This year, I've focused more on myself. I've always been so, so true to myself, I feel. And I've always been that person, like, if I don't think it's right and if it doesn't feel in my heart, I'm not gonna do it. I don't care if it's family, I don't care if it's friends, I don't care if it's business, like, I don't care. If it doesn't feel good to me, I'm not gonna do it, you know? So this year, I've been focusing more on, on what personal development is and I can't wait to teach you guys and to show you guys a whole new game when it comes to paradigms. I don't know if you guys ever heard about what paradigms is. Um, I started learning myself through mentors here on YouTube and it's amazing. It's amazing and 
that's going to be another video, another topic about paradigms, but I've grown so much and I'm very, very blessed and I have the time. I've started creating habits. I started creating a schedule on managing my life. Now as a mother of two, my kids are full time in daycare. So I have the time to upload you guys. I have the time to film and just teach you guys and learn and learn together and tell you guys more about me. And I know people love it. You guys love it. And I've been getting subscribers, like I said, throughout the years that I haven't been posting on YouTube. So now that I'm going to be more active, yeah, you guys, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. If you guys are not subscribed to my channel, feel free to do so. Um, if you guys do subscribe, don't forget to turn on the bell notification so you guys can get notified every time I post a new video. I will bring you guys into the studio as well so you guys can see our services, what we offer. I'm going to go ahead and get Saida in this video because she's someone very, very important in my life. And I've been growing so much with her when it comes to business. So yeah, you guys, I can't wait. I can't wait for this new journey all over again here on YouTube. And yeah, stay tuned and yeah it was it was great talking and i love it you guys it feeds my soul and i'm here for you guys and if you guys have any questions feel free to comment down below and i'll see you guys in my next video